Hello, it's Anne here. I'm just about to do my fortnightly grocery shop. This is the first one for 2020. I did stock up quite a bit on pantry goods just before Christmas, so there's not a lot that I need in relation to pantry items, but mainly just fresh fruit and vegetables and um, dairy, eggs, bread, that sort of thing. So I'll be sharing my grocery haul um, coming up in the next slide. Thank you. I've just got back with the groceries and I'm just about to share with you what I bought today on my $150 budget for the fortnight. So I got two avocados, some tomatoes, baby cos lettuce, potatoes, um, watermelon, red grapes, Spanish onion, green onions or shallots, bananas, onions, white sugar, white flour, red cordial or apple and raspberry cordial, a tin of tuna, some eggs, shredded coconut, tortilla wraps, smoked paprika, beef stock powder, four one litre boxes of milk, two loaves of bread, some English muffins, uh, frozen mixed green vegetables, frozen broccoli, pitted Kalamata olives, sugar-free maple syrup, corn flour, tomato sauce, special burger sauce, organic assay, um, assay puree, frozen, um, two bags of frozen crinkle cut chips, frozen pineapple, Greek yogurt, a kilo of frozen fish, um, two boxes of 400 gram chicken, crumb chicken breast tenders, salami, sausages, a kilo of bacon, a pork shoulder roast, a beef mince, ham and some paper towels, a paper serviettes. So um, that's what I got in my order today. It's the first big shop that I've done since probably... Um, the weekend before Christmas and uh, although I didn't need a lot from for the pantry I needed quite a bit of fresh stuff and topped up on meat and I normally have been finding it better when I do the online order and then just pick it up that way I can make sure that I stick to my budget. I started going around the supermarket today with my calculator and then every time my phone turned off then it got bumped and I lost the total so I kind of just winged it today and um, did I stick to my 150 budget no I didn't unfortunately I went slightly over uh, paying 169.84 so I'm 19 20 dollars over uh, which doesn't leave very much or well, doesn't leave anything from the 150 budget to top up on milk or fruit or dog food for next week but um, we're pretty stocked up this will all this food will definitely last us and if we have to buy more fruit or milk so be it but it's just um, another uh, reminder to me that um, I just need to do that online order beforehand to make sure that I stick to my budget or just get a calculator to go around the supermarket I usually do stick to under my 150 without doing uh, adding it up as I go or the online order because I've just been so used to buying the same things, but because I was um, a bit low on all the fruit and vegetables uh, today and the meat, I thought I could um, manage it. Like I didn't really need to buy the pork shoulder roast. There was $13.25. Also, these um, acai, this acai puree was $8, but I... Um, really love smoothie bowls so I'm going to start having them um, making them here at home instead of paying 10 or 12 dollars when I'm out I probably only needed one bag of crinkle cut chips and maybe I didn't need the fish or the chicken but it's there and it's going to last us for two weeks so um, that's my order for today thank you